premature males through the post um, and they're all from sellers on RF UK. Um, great packaging for all three of them. Um, really good boxes, enclosures, tarantulas were enclosed and then put into these. My mature male P. striata from um, uh, the guy on RF UK is Unforgiven. That's you and, and then four the uh, number, Forgiven. So Unforgiven. Uh, great review. I'm um, going to breed him with my female striata. Um, then I've got the fringe ornamental as well, and that's from a guy on RF UK, um, KN, and I think you pronounce that Morris. So it's KN Morris on RF UK. Um, big shout out, great review as well. Um, and then finally, my mature male P. Crane Bridgie Eye, uh, which I'm going to breed in a few weeks as well. I uh, haven't opened any of these three up. So I'm going to basically just cut the video and try and see if I can get them out of their tubs into the temporary accommodation and show you how I do that. So thanks. Hey guys, I'm just going to carry on the transfer video of the mature male Cambridge Eye first of all. Um, and I'm going to put him, I actually put most, actually all three of them um, into enclosures like this. They're just basically cereal tubs, uh, enough holes drilled all the way around for cross ventilation. Um, and on the inside there is a hide bark there and also a water dish. Um, and underneath there I've put a little bit of uh, uh, vermiculite just to keep it humid. There's plastic tubs so it'll keep humidity. But the holes in there as you can see are quite a uh, decent size. Obviously not for the tea to get through but uh, maybe you get a few, uh, few crickets getting through there if they can climb up. But um, yeah, so what I'm going to do is transfer the Cambridge AI into my catchy cup and which is called catch cup there um, and try and shoot it it's a bit difficult because I'm uh, going to basically video in this on my own but I'll try and position the video so uh, you get a good shot hopefully all right thanks for watching